In this second part of episode 3, we are going to create the footer component. Now that we have the navbar and the home component, let's create the footer component. Like the navbar component, we're going to place it into the template folder. As usual, we declare it in the app component. Here it is. Now let's shape it. This time, we'll create a div of class BG Dark, Text Light, Text Center, with P5 as overall padding, and zero margin. This will make the footer dark with centered text. Inside the division, we're just gonna put some regular copyright stuff. Here it is. The footer looks good, however there is something I want to highlight. Usually, in modern web design, when you come across a website, the footer should not be shown on the main view of the page. Let's fix that real quick. In the app component, we'll create a div of class main view that groups the navbar and the home component. Let's now define the main view class in the app component as CSS. To keep the footer just below your screen device view, we'll define a minimum height of 100 VH. Perfect, this is way better. Now let's adjust the home component to make it look like the final app. Great, now we have to add some spacing between the navbar and the title. To do so, we'll create a class named Pages. Here, we'll just add some padding at the top of the division. Alright. This looks much cleaner. I hope you enjoyed this video. In the next part, We'll create the contact and about components. See you tomorrow.